do you guys feel like this is a modern thing that it was in the old days that there were more randomness in board games and that it's uh, more yeah, about uh, the, that it, the idea of how a game should be designed has changed somehow or do you even care about this <laughs> yeah I think I well everything evolves right so board games evolve as well I think I mean they weren't that that complex before and now they are so of course you gotta follow the uh, the path I guess yeah yeah I mean not I mean it depends on the audience too I think like zoneplex has it it's so dependent on the game group and it's been really successful with people who like someone emailed me saying they they had like a two-year Dungeons and Dragon campaign going and that's insane they took a break for two weeks and just played zoneplex and it totally worked because it, like in Dungeons and Dragons everything's so dependent on the group of players you're playing with and zoneplex kind of allowed them to still be the same group and then have this twist at the end where they have to turn on each other so it might not be a twist they could have done in the actual Dungeons and Dragons so I think I think in the end that's our our target audience is role-playing gamers that want to delve into board games that like a little bit of both worlds so in some respects I think I'm glad we did board game geek as our first uh, convention and kickoff convention but I think like a gen con or a more role-playing game oriented that has board games would be the place for zoneplex and place for demoing zoneplex I, ho I hope we can do it with the expansion like next year or something